Ladies and gentlemen, the day you have been waiting for, the crossover of a lifetime, Light meets Light. How do I know his name? I mean, I've never watched Harry Potter, but, but I know who Harry Potter is. But Nick, the show isn't called Light. I've never watched Dragon Ball Z, but I know who Goku is. No, no way. You have to watch it. There's no way you know who Goku is. So today we begin Death Note. Let's just get to the damn show, okay? Before I lose interest. Wow, I feel like I just entered the cathedral, but I'm a Satanist. Oh my god. Shinigami Realm. So I'm guessing this is what they're called, the Shinigamis. Holy shit, wait a minute. First of all, this- That is so sick. I feel like- the devil. I already love the darkness. Call me depressing or whatever. I, I hate soft shit. I'm into that depressing shit that makes me want to jump off the top of my building. His name is Rook. Oh my god, I already love the voice actors! Bro, what is this music? Did he just seduce the entire classroom? I love how they all stopped just to listen to him. They all look at him. When I spoke in front of a classroom, or I had to read a sentence, nobody looked at me. They would talk to each other still. He probably gets all the bitches. I'm guessing this is light. Yeah, it's light. It's light Yagami. This fucking music is powerful. So is this like modern day Japan? Oh, I feel you with that. I love that transition from light to Rook. Oh my god! What an intro! That was sick! The transition and showing Rook, I hope I'm saying his name right, and Lights showing the perspective of each character, and I assume they're gonna meet soon. The Death Note. Okay, that's the book. So it just fell from the sky. I'm guessing the Shinigami realm. This is how they're gonna meet. Okay, the soundtrack in this this show is just phenomenal so far. It's so distinctive. Did nobody else see that fall from the sky? I wouldn't even pick it up. It's a fucking book. I don't care if a thousand of them fell from the sky. I'm still not picking it up. Holy shit, I wish I had this book. The amount of names I'd write on this one. Who would be first? I have a couple X's I would put in this book. Bro, put that in your fucking bag. Damn, yo, he does get the bitches. Look at this. Oh my god, take them to the back. He looks like he's bored with life. He needs some excitement. Yeah, he got it. Oh, I have my ex's face in my mind. I'd love to write her name down. Oh shit. I don't want to give them a heart attack. I'd write a very specific reason to die, especially my ex's. Ooh, I love this dynamic so far. He found a book. And in this book, he could literally solve crime. He's God. He's basically God right now. He could determine who lives and who dies. I love how he believes this right away. Like, he finds this fall from the sky. So stupid, but you picked up the fucking bug, didn't you? I'd pick it up, too. And I hate books. Oh, he's ready. He has a whole list of names in his head. He's ready to fucking murder. Bro, imagine the first name he puts is his own name. Or his dad's. Oh my god, that's so dope. That's such a perfect way to test this out. Let's take a criminal. What if the dude didn't do it? What if he's just... Al uh, it's an allegation. I'm already loving this. Damn, he just went... Sh sh oh, he's better. Turn that shit off. Oh my god, no way. That's so dope. <laughs> oh my god. Wow, I'm sadistic. Someone just literally killed themselves and I'm, I'm smiling and laughing over here. Oh my god. Listen, guys. You know I'm a slut for music. Especially like an OST on a show. In this anime, the OST is so fucking good so far. When they were in a Shinigami realm, it, it made me feel like I was being possessed by Beezlebob. Now, now I'm in the human realm, and just this, this old school 90s boom bap they have going on in the background. Loving this. Hey mom, I'm a, I'm a murderer now. I just killed a man. Now I'm going to school to learn about math. There has to be repercussions to this. 
Oh, kill these motherfuckers. Oh, I wish I had this death note in school. Write their names. I know you know their names. The pieces of shit. I would have cared. Just kill both of them. Same time. Wow, this is definitely from the 90s. Going to the arcade after school. Absolutely. Damn, she's ready to suck. You do me a favor too. Kill them. Oh, kill them. Oh, figure out. Ew, what the fuck? What's your name? Taco Shababar? No, no, no. Motherfucker looks like a titan. Oh, where's the, where's the fucking city? Ah! <laughs> oh, what a fucking idiot! He gets off the bike and he says his full name. That's like if I said, Hi, my name is Nicholas Light to some stranger. What a fucking dumbass. You deserve it, brother. Make the motorcycle explode. And then their bodies. Do Light, you're a hero. Come here, let me sucky sucky. Baka! That's what y'all get. You wanna be a fucking creep? Get hit by a car. This note will not take effect unless the writer has the person's face in their mind when writing his or her name. Therefore, people sharing the same name will not be affected. See, I love that that, that anime goes into this. Like a normal American show, they would not add that last part. People sharing the same name will not be affected. You'll be trying to understand that till the end of a show for an American TV show cartoon. But with anime in Japan, they explain every little thing. The Pythagorean theorem will be explained. <laughs> oh, okay. Holy shit, this is awesome! What the fuck? My dude, Rook got drip on his ears. You see that shit? Look at this. Dude, that's the heart. Oh, I need that. Okay, I gotta look up how to say his name because I don't want y'all cringing every time I try to say his name. All right, so it's Ryuk. It's not Rook. Why did I say Rook? Thank God I looked this up. Okay, Ryuk. Ryuk. Thank God y'all told me to react to this show. I'm already loving this. This is awesome. Look at this. So each Shinigami has a death note. Whoever picks it up is like the host. Who the fuck needs school when you have the death note? Give it a test and then kill her. Damn, I never would tell my mom that. I'm studying, so don't interrupt me. I'd say I'm studying, interrupt me. Like, please, I don't want to study. Damn, Japan's just different. He's a different light. We're not the same light. He's dark. See, I'd close my doors, but for different reasons. Not to read, but but to watch some certain videos. Damn, oh my god. He turned into the devil! He ain't light! <laughs> Yo, I'd fucking have a heart attack. Damn, he, he accepted that just like this? You're telling me, if a Shinigami appeared in your room, that you would accept it like light? Maybe this is what makes him different. Maybe that's why he's smart. A dumbass like me, i jump out that fucking window. I don't care how high it is. He's ready to be the devil. You sure light isn't the Shinigami? <laughs> oh shit! This dude wrote a novel already! A novel of names! Of course. Okay. God damn! Oh, choke me! That has to be like a Shinigami girl or some shit. Ooh, oh, bring them to me. I want her death note. So it's like the it's like fairy godparents. Like from like fairly odd parents with Timmy Turner. Like he could pass down his godparents, but then he'll forget everything. Oh, there's gonna be a price. What? Oh shit, bro, I throw that book in the fucking fire! Oh, he's going to hell. Oh, she's not going to see him. Yeah, she's not going to see him. Because only the person that holds the book can see him, I'm guessing. Dark. That's literally my room every day. Since I was a kid. There's just something so demonic about the lighting being so dark and then the apple being red. It's like Adam and Eve. 
with the apple and ooh, the devil and God. I'm liking this. But wouldn't the, 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 wouldn't the apple be floating right now if someone came in and saw that? Oh, I love Ryuk. Juicy. Juicy. <laughs> so how do you say juicy in Japan? Oh, he was chosen. I don't care what he says. Oh, he was chosen. Oh, shit! That has to be a Shinigami girl, bro. They probably give some good head. Yo, imagine you're just in your room getting head from a Shinigami. And someone walks in and they just see you like this, like, I'd bring that Shinigami everywhere, unless they follow you. That's such a <laughs> sick design. His eyes remind me of, like, scrambled eggs. I just want to eat them. Yeah, Light already knows everything. He studied this book front to back. He knows rules when you won't find out until season six. Damn. So he's guide. Light is guide. Oh my god, they're like, one of the same. Oh shit. I can't take the smile on my face. I'm loving this. Look at him. He's a hero. Sacrificing his own human nature, his own being, to benefit the world. Hell yeah. It sounds like me. But he sounds a little crazy. So is he a hero or is he going to be the villain? This dude has a training montage for, for writing in a book. I'm loving this shit. <laughs> oh. The fuck? This is the craziest shit. It's like the pen is his, is his weapon. He's like a rapper. Writing diss tracks. It really has to drag me in from the first episode, and this is really bringing me in. Like, this just makes me so excited to see where this could go. God, light. You got the devil afraid of you! <laughs> is that the end of the first episode? Because that would have been perfect. Oh, oh, oh my god, oh. Oh, 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 beautiful, beautiful. We got to talk about this, beautiful. When I watch a show, it doesn't always have to drag me in from that first episode. Like sometimes I'll give it the three episode check. If it doesn't get me after three episodes, I'm probably not going to pick up the show. I'm probably not going to watch it. That's how I've always been with shows. And that's how I am right now with anime. It really has to drag me in. First episode, complete banger. It just sets up the show. Like, it's this character that, that, that just has the power of God in his hands right now. And now he's gonna wave, like, waver between light and the dark. His name is Light, for fuck's sake. Incredible. And now he has the devil by his side, and the devil is afraid of him. You have, like, God and the devil together right now. Are they portraying God as the real devil? Hmm. Things to think about. But I'm loving where this show could possibly go. Like, he is gonna take advantage of this book. He's gonna write as many names as he can, and he thinks he's gonna be doing it justice. It, aren't the police gonna notice this? Like, all these criminals are just dying? But this isn't good, because this guy has the power to just kill anyone he wants. What if someone does something wrong, but they're actually an amazing person? They just make one mistake. Then you kill them, it's like, are you really doing that good? I mean, we all make mistakes, you know? We all have those shitty moments in our lives. So it's a lot to think about. I don't think he's going to end up being like a hero. You know, anyone with the power of God in their hands is bound to end up as the villain. And I feel like he's going to become a villain, definitely. Like, Ryuk is loving this. He's like, I was bored. I, I brought this book to and I wrote this shit in English. Now, 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 now you have the power. I'm loving it. Anyways, yeah, I'm in. I'm in. Now I, I want a fucking apple now. I want a big batch of apples. Anyways, guys, I will see you all in the next Death Note reaction. Yes, I'm going to continue. Of course. How could I not? His name is Light, for fuck's sake. I want you guys to let me know down below 
what did you think the first time you saw Death Note? I know it's been around for like fucking centuries. So let me know. Do you remember your first experience with Death Note? Did it really drag you in from that first episode? Is it your favorite anime? Let me know down below. Goodbye.